Hi, my name is Patrick and I work in the London office at Guidebook. In this video I'm going to be showing you how to navigate Builder and how to edit the layout of your guide. In the centre you'll see how your guide looks on your user's screens. On the left hand side you'll see your feature drawer and on the right you'll see your build progress. I'm going to hop into schedule and you can see by clicking on the different panes you'll be able to access different parts of your schedule. Now I'm going to add new features. You can scroll down and see a list of all the features you can add to your guide. I'm going to add a contacts feature. And you'll see it appear on the left hand feature drawer. You can drag and drop to move features around. You can click into settings to choose the name of your feature. To enable or disable it to your users. And select if you want this to be the home feature of your guide. You can also delete by going to the settings of any feature. Now I'm going to add a folder. Folders are really useful for organising the features in your guide. Simply drag and drop the different features you want to put into your folder and drag and drop to remove. Click on the three parallel dots to edit the appearance of your folder. You can edit the name and also choose which icon you want your folder to take. I'm going to go to Guidebook Icons scroll down, pick this icon and change it to a nice turquoise colour. You can also generate a preview of your guide so you can see what your guide looks like as you build. This is a static version of your guide and does not update automatically. To download your preview simply enter the password automatically generated into your guidebook app and then hit download guide and open. Now you can see the preview of your guide. I'll open the feature drawer and you can see all the features we've built already. Just remember, downloading updates are disabled in preview mode. And there you have it. That's how easy it is to edit the layout of your guide.